first time coming to the channel, please consider subscribing if you like anything about this video. If you're not new, welcome, welcome, welcome back. But before we get into this video, make sure you like, subscribe, hit that bell to be notified, and also check out my social media. It's going to be right there in the corner. Now, let's get into the video. As you can tell by the title, I'm going to be telling you how, well, showing you how I trim my hair at home, my natural hair at home. And it's very simple. All you need is some shears, okay? So first, Disclaimer, um, I'm not a like professional. I, said, I just so want like, to share this with you guys. Before you start so with anything, you I'm trying to make sure that my hair is sectioned off in some type of twist or something like that so i can see where my hair needs to be trimmed at and as you can tell on this twist you see how it's curly like it's twisted but then once it get right here it's kind of like frizzed out that's the part that i'll be trimming that's the only part i'll be trimming i won't be trimming like up here or anything like that it's just right here on these pieces so for the first one as you can tell you can see that little hair right there. That's the part that I'm going to trim. So I'm just going to take my handy dandy shears and get close to it. And trim it off. And there you go. And that's how I trim my hair at home. So I'm going to go through all of them just to see. So you can see. See that little frizz part? I'm just going to trim it off. Okay. And it makes your hair look so much better when you trim that little piece off. And they mesh well. This piece. Let's see. And then another piece. Like that. So this is basically how I trim my hair. I know I'm overdue for a trim trim like I want to, but this is just to keep my hair in it to where it's able to grow without me getting a trim trim. You know what I'm saying? So that's what I do in between trims and stuff like that. So just to keep my hair healthy, you know, and growing. So you don't want to cut too much. Like I said, it's just a trim. You know what a trim is. It's not like cutting, cutting, cutting. So you want to make sure that you get the best from it. So yeah, y'all can tell, like I'll be telling y'all, shrinkage is real. So you see that little freeze part right there? I'm just going to take, take that and then it's, um, angle it down to get the best cut. So you won't start your hair growth. So that's what I'll be doing. And there you go. See, I probably have to cut some more. Yeah. There you go. So this is what I do when I'm at home and I need a trim. I just cut my own hair. Well, cut my natural hair and it's it's barely even cutting. Like, like I said, it's just a trim. So I'm not even cutting that much. Just to make sure that all the frizzy ends that I see, they don't, you know. See, this one has a lot. As you can tell, like, this has a lot of frizz. So, I'm going to make sure I cut close enough to where the frizz is going. And there you go. See this piece? You see that part? So, I'm just going to cut right here. It's kind of hard to cut, trim your own hair, you know, but it's worth it. It's manageable if you want a good, nice, if you want your twist to look good or your natural hair to look good and not frizzy, then you're, you're able to do it. Let's see? So it's not that hard to trim your own hair, you know? It's hard to see the back part, though. But, I mean, I'm able to see it to the best of my ability, this part. That's crazy. You have to, like, look with one eye so you can see. Sometimes you don't have to cut that much. It's just a little small section. 
but this one has a lot of frizz as you can tell so i'm going to make sure that i cut that i cut as much as possible down so let's see this one this one got some frizz on it so yeah that's basically it that's how i trim my hair at home so my hair looks way different from what it did before when i had those frizzy pieces on so yeah it's just a little trim this is how i do it at home like i said um i make sure it, your hair doesn't have to be wet or anything like that or it could be dry i just wash my hair so so it's not that you know um dirty or anything and i'm actually able to see where my hair needs to be trimmed so i hope you enjoyed this video if you did comment down below do you think i mean have you tried to trim your hair at home if you did let me know your technique i would glad be glad to hear it basically how i trim my hair at home is very simple very easy all you need is a pair of shears and that's it handy dandy shears and you'll be good to go just to trim you know up a little bit of your hair um of the frizz that ha well happens to my hair or it might happen to you so if you enjoyed this video don't forget to like subscribe hit that bell to be notified hit the bell hit the bell because it's right here in the corner and if you don't hit the bell you won't know when i drop another video and also it helps me out a lot because i'm on the road to 500 subscribers and if you want to be a part of the fam make sure you hit that subscribe button as well as the notification bell so you know when i drop another video and i hope you enjoyed this if you did thanks for watching always remember to love yourself and be yourself and i will see you in the next video